Fulham have made another signing. Joining the club is uh, Fabrico Ramirez, otherwise known as Fabri. Uh, he is the Ben uh, Besiktas number one, and he is joining Fulham for the season. So they lost David Button um, to Brighton. He went. Um, so they have brought in another goalkeeper, sort of to replace him. Whether he'll be a number one or whether he'll be behind, number two um, behind Marcus Bettinelli remains to be seen. Um, but they have signed the Spanish goalkeeper. Um, so who is he? Well, he started his career off at uh, De Deportivo La Coruña and then went to uh, Valladolid. Uh, he spent time at Real Betis um, and Deportivo again. And in 2016, he joined uh, Besiktas. Um, he has been number one at Besiktas for both seasons. He is a very, 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 um, you know, one of the best goalkeepers in the Turkish league. Um, you know, so he has been a uh, under-20 international with Spain, but says he would want to play for uh, Uruguay if... He was ever given the chance, which is looking slim now he is 30. Uh, but they needed to bring in another goalkeeper after they lost him. Um, and, you know, he looks very, very good. Um, once again, they are signing players of high quality. Um, you know, he's a very high quality signing, as was uh, Lee Marchand and, of course, uh, Jean-Marcel Serri. So, you know, once again, another, another, you know, good signing. So they have um, just... Marcus Bettinelli. They also have, you know, a few goalkeepers that have been out on loan. Um, Rodak, um, who was at Rotherham, he's about now. Um, but they probably needed somebody that was a bit better than, you know, Rodak, who had been on loan in League One. And that's exactly what they have got in uh, Fabry, who will join the club up um, soon and then be ready for the first uh, game of the season. So I think Fulham are nearly there with what they need. They probably maybe need a few more players they certainly need to tie down um to tie down Mitrovic they need to try and sign Mitrovic in the summer because it's he's so important uh, to how well they played at the end of last season um and it's really important they you know show their their grit and show why you know they deserve to be a Premier League club they need to sign him because he was so important um, to them last year. So they start off um, on the 11th of August against Crystal Palace at home before going to Wembley to face Spurs and then have um, Burnley a week later. So that's their uh, first three games. They're an exciting club to watch. I mean, this signing isn't, you know, as amazing as Jean-Michel Serri, um, but, you know, it's still a very, very good signing, you know, and provides cover. Uh, for you know where they missed it, where they need it now, Button has you know descended to Brighton and Hove Albion, um, so it's a good signing, and Jukanovic is starting to build his Fulham squad ready for the campaign. You know they they still need one or two more players, um, but they might get those in the following weeks. I think Mitrovic will happen. It's just a bit of a waiting game at the minute, um, but yeah. So another signing has happened, and Fulham have signed. Uh, Fabri, thanks so much for watching this video. If you are new, subscribe. I cover all uh, transfers and you know everything like that, and the Premier League. And I will start to uh, cover the football league and non-league in a few weeks when it all starts up. But you know, there are so many transfers that I couldn't you know cover everything. But I do cover um, the Premier League transfers. So subscribe if you are new or you know don't if you don't like it but whatever. Thanks so much for watching this video anyway. My name is Mike and I will see you soon.